are the future of industrial robotics is clearly collaborative. We want people to interact as closely as possible with robots in ways that make it safe but also efficient. I'm with Pietro Ottavis. He's the chief operating officer of Comal. And uh, Pietro, we're standing in front of what it looks like a very soft padded, almost like a teddy bear, this, yeah, this, this right. robot. That's Tell right. me about it. Yeah, this is, we call it a sensitive skin. So we started at Comal from a standard industrial robot and then we literally dress it up with this uh, skin. This, uh, this skin has a sensor eyes with, uh, with sensor that uh, measure proximity as well as pressure. Uh, this, uh, together with, uh, with um, a vision system, provide a full, uh, six, up to six layers of safety. And therefore make this uh, standard industrial robot a collaborative one. Collaborative in the sense that it can collaborate also with a machine like this AGV. So this is a technology that we develop and we're going to bring it to the market by the end of this year. So the industrialization phase is ongoing and it's a unique solution because actually the good thing is that it works in collaborative mode when you are here, but when you're out of the place, yes. then it works in full speed yes. because it's an it's a, uh, absolutely standard uh, industrial robot. This is a 110 kilogram payload. We have a development for a 170 kilogram payload, but also scaling down to a five kilogram payload. So, it can serve automotive applications as well as any other, you know, pick and place application. So this AGV is um, is obviously um, equipped with a, a laser scanner on the top. Yes. And then he has a very high payload up to 1.5 ton. You can actually move a car with this guy. Okay. As a software, there's a navigation software to make it fully autonomous and fully programmable. That's a solution at Comau we are developing. We connect all those so that you can monitor remotely the state of, uh, of the robot and you can pre uh, predict some intervention in case it's needed. So this is really industry 4.0 already in place. Great, so which industries do you anticipate would take best advantage of this? this technology? Uh, first, first of all, automotive, for sure for some heavy load uh, tasks automotive will do like loading a battery, loading an engine. But actually we are studying this and offering this already and having some pilot program in place for logistics application, food and beverage application, palletizing application, all the way to electronics. Obviously electronic manufacturing also pick and place will uh, take uh, get a lot of benefit from this, uh, from this technology. Pietro, do you expect to, to sell the AGV and the robot together in a unified system? Is that a typical way? That's a possibility, but uh, actually the various applications that we're having are separated. AGV typically go into end-of-line application as well as logistic application. This goes into other steps, but, but we see also application possibly together, but it's both basically. By the way, this guy can also be working in manual mode, so you have a manual guidance possibility. So manually you can teach him, literally teaching an operation. This gives flexibility, by the way. And then the algorithm will replicate the operation uh, in the field. So basically even a non-expert of uh, software and robotics programming can actually use it, teach the operation, and then it's going to be replicated there. Victor, it's clearly a highly capable robot. It's also beautiful. Now, it's, we see, of course, robotics are manufactured by manufacturers around the world. Yeah. And yet, oddly, things manufactured in Italy, even industrial devices yeah. that are never meant to yeah. be seen by the public, are beautiful. That's Why? right. <laughs> well, it's part of our DNA, okay? Obviously, we're passionate of technology. Comau works in, uh, in uh, robotics applications since more than 40 years. But also, we, we pay a particular attention to the design. We have a design team. They do nothing else than just really make sure that it's nice. It's nice to see, it's nice to look, it's, now to, it's nice to touch. And that's what we care a lot. You see all our, our solutions, even the AGV, are pretty nice from a stylish standpoint. Practical, efficient, collaborative robotics and possibly the most attractive robot ever from Comau. This is Pietro Otavis.